Hey guys, welcome back or welcome to my channel. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day and a wonderful life, of course. As y'all already know, today I'm going to be unboxing two iPhone Nanos. The first one is going to be the third generation and then the fifth generation. I got them both in a green color. They do have some pink colors here and there, but I'm just really into green, so I decided to get this one. So I actually bought this one from Macari. I got it for $38 minus the tax and the shipping and everything like that. As y'all already seen, it's not in the worst condition. It's actually pretty good. This one already had music pre-installed, so I didn't really do much in it. I'm just like going through it. Some of these kind of remind me of like my middle school, high school years. Um, but I'm thinking I might just put like nostalgic music from middle school and high school that I personally listen to. I don't know, I'm still thinking about it. Something I forgot to show you guys on my iPod Classic was the games on there. I'm going to show you guys later in the video, but I just wanted to show you guys that these do also have games as well. Some of them kind of is the same, some of them might be different, but for the most part, it's pretty much the same thing. This one here is the iPod Nano 5th generation in green as well. It's in 8 gigabytes and I got this one for like 50 something dollars with tax and everything all up in there. But this one I'm deciding to just keep gospel or Christian music on here. I typically listen to English speaking, Spanish speaking, and recently um, Korean gospel music as well. So I'm into that type of atmosphere. But yeah. Some of my favorite artists will have to be like Lily Goodman and Tian Mansio, um, Gaither Band, the Gaither Vocal Band, Tamala Man. Recently got into Jonathan McReynolds, I think that's his name. I don't know, there's just, there's just a lot, but yeah. So the camera kind of surprised me. I never really had this one when I was younger. I think I might have had like a classic one, but I was kind of surprised that it came with a camera. My dumb self did not know that. And yeah, it gives you like Y2K vibes. It's really, really cute. I also recorded a video of me watching Power Book 3. Was it Book 2? I don't know. One of them, John. I still like my iPod Classic rather than the Nano ones. One, because it's modded, has a better battery and everything. It just lasts longer. So Nano ones, I typically have to charge them every day or every two days, to be quite honest. And the iPod Classic, because it's modded, I just charge it maybe once a week. It depends how much, how much I use it in that week. But I'm gonna leave down the link below for Elite Obsolete Electronics. That's where I got my iPod Classic from. They also have nanos, they have the iPod touches as well. They have a plethora of different devices. So I would really suggest to check them out. But yeah, that's gonna be it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. And also thank you guys so much for letting me hate 6K. Y'all some real ones. Thank you so, so much. And I hope that my videos can bring you peace and entertainment. But yeah, I'll see y'all on the next one. Deuces.